Assalamu alaikum, hürmetli uçuşlar. Bugün sizler bilen bir gelikte 5. sınıf dasturge ait bölgen 4. çorakmin 1. mavzusunu başla bulamız. Demek bugün mavzuyumuz Lesson 1 My Favorite Season Benim sevimli faslım. So, you know in Uzbekistan we have 4 seasons. Spring, winter, summer and autumn. So, according to our program Exercise second A. Look and answer the questions. We have here three questions. Guys, please look attentively. You are given four pictures. According to these pictures, you should give the clear answers. The first question. Demek birinci savolni o'qib olamiz. Savollarni o'qib, rasmlar bilan birgalikda ishlab, savollarga javob berishga harakat qilamiz. So, the first one. How many seasons are there in Uzbekistan? Let me repeat. How many seasons are there in Uzbekistan? Anglab turgan ingizdik, Uzbekistan'da neşte fasıl bor deyli yaptı. You can see, looking at the pictures, rasımlarga qarab cevap verişiniz mümkün. Bizde 1, 2, 3, 4 demek, tortta fasıl bor. Okay, you can even count their names. Hatta ki biz onların nomlarını ham sanab çıkışımız mümkün. So, the first picture, everything is green, it is the fresh air and blue sky. So, you can guess, it is spring. Korturgan gizdik, hamma yok, yam yashil, osman musafo, toza hava, demek manzarada biz baharını tasvirle yapmız. So, the next one. So, what can you see here? It is lots of snows and it's cold and the trees are frozen. Korturgan gizdik. Bu rasımda kor koruna yaptı, hava soğuk yavuk şeydi ve daraklarımız muzlab kolgen. Demek ki bu faslımız winter, albatta kış. So, dear pupils, pay attention to the third picture. So, the leaves are falling. Everything is yellow and green. So, it's getting cooler and cooler day by day. Demek ki, ahimiyet bir etken bu sengiz. Bargiler tokile otkenliği ve sargış renklerimiz bizge kuz faslı ikerlikten derek veredi. So, it is autumn. Now, the last picture. Pay attention to the last picture. It is the river is flowing very softly and the pictures, the trees are blossoming and everything is clear, the sun is shining, it is very hot. What season can it be? Of course, it is the summer, your favorite season because you have holiday vacation in this period. Now guys, let me read the question two. What are winter, spring, summer, autumn months? Can you guess? We have four seasons and each of the season has three months. Let me count it. In winter, can you tell me which months do we have in winter? Okay, let's count together. December, January and February. Three months includes in winter. So the next season, spring. So it has March, April and May. Next one, summer. Summer, June, July and August. And of course the last season is autumn. September, October, and November. Now guys, the last question. Please read it with me and do the task together. Which is your favorite season? Of course, giving answer is up to you. Because always we have different tests. So the last question, which is your favorite season? You should answer it yourselves. So as for me, my favorite season is summer because I have holiday, vacation, I will go to the mountains, I will have a rest with my family, I can do whatever I want. So what about you? Please guys, write the full answers to your notebooks. And now, next exercise. Second, B. Pay attention, you are given four texts. According to these texts, we should read, translate, of course. You should know the vocabulary because without the vocabulary, you cannot get the text, get the meaning of the text. 
So, read and match the pictures. As we have learned about the pictures and we described it, now we will read the definition of them. The first one, A. Let's read it together. After hot days, it is cool. The days are shorter, but I can eat a lot of fruit and vegetables. Every day, my friends and I go for walks and play football. We go to school. Can you guess what season is it? In which season the days is cool? Remember, please. The days are shorter, it is shorter, the nights are longer than the days. I can eat a lot of fruit and vegetables. What season can it be? Of course, it is autumn. Good job. So, the next one. B. The days are so beautiful. There is snow on the trees and houses. It is cold. But I can ski and play snowballs. Do you know what is snowballs? You will just take the, a bit of snows and hit your friend. Okay, at home I play computer games and read books. Because of the cold weather, of course, it's better to stay at home and do some reading. Guys, can you guess what season is it? What can it be? Of course, when it's cold and when, it's, when you play snowballs. So, there is usually in winter. So, the picture, which picture can it be? Can you see? Yeah, this is the second picture. It is cold. Now, the next text. C. The sun shines a lot. The days are sunny and hot. Can you guess? It is hot. It does not rain. There is no rain. Almost. Yeah, it doesn't rain. I can eat ice cream. Your favorite thing, I know. And swim in the river. Do you know? I'm showing the action swimming. So, the water in the river is warm. So, of course, when you get hot, when you eat ice cream and when you swim in the rivers, it is somewhere. Okay, good job. Now the last text. D. The days are longer and the nights are shorter. The days are nice and warm. There are a lot of beautiful flowers. Yes, a lot of beautiful flowers that are blossoming. Which season can it be? Okay, let's continue. Swallows and other birds are here. Do you know what can the swallows be the sign? Okay, let's continue. I can fly a kite. Little children like flying a kite when the season comes. So, run, jump and play games in the yard. Of course, why not? When the air is fresh, and it's blossoming and it smells very good. It's better to be outside with your friends. So, can you guess what season can it be? Of course, it is the most beautiful and blossoming season, spring. Okay, now guys, as a homework, you can tell your parents or friends or your relatives anyone you like about the four seasons and its weather and its climate even. So, for example, it is spring. Now it is spring. It is warm. In spring, the trees are green. We have clean yards. Everything is clean. Yeah, it should be. On the farms, there are baby animals on the farms. They are jumping, playing, so we like this view. I can play. So, what can you play? If the weather is fine, if it's spring, what can you do? Please continue the sentence and make a little bit about yourself. So, 
Now it is time to learn about some grammar rules. Because here, when I describe it, the theme about seasons, I use it present simple. And of course, here I can play. So the modal verb can. It shows the possibility uh, what someone can do. As you notice, in our lesson, I use it present simple. So, present simple, what is it? How can we translate it? They might present simple bu qanday zaman, albatta hazırgi oddi zaman. Aziz okuçularım, biz present simple'dan kaçan faydalanamaz. Albatta kundalik hayatımızda odatki aylanıp qolgan va albatta turmuş tartımızda tez-tez bacaradigan, har doyum, onda sonda, bazan, hatta ki heç kaçan bacarmaydigan şarketlerimizin ha, uç bu zaman orkali ifadelayımız. Demek, Ahamiyat berishingiz kerak bo'lgan asosiy bir qoida. Bu zamonlarni o'rganishda ularning yordamchi fillari bilan to'g'ri ishlashdir. Biz uni o'rganishni 3 qismga, ya'ni 3 formulaga bo'lib olamiz. Keling, diqqatingizni ushbu doskaga qarataman. Birinchi formulamiz. Voy. İngiliz tildə zamanlarının orqanışının en asan yolu bu, onu üçte formulaya acıratıb alıb və xar biri də kumakçı, yəni yardımcı fillərimizdən doğru faydalana alışdır. Demək, birinci şəkilimiz dərək şəkili. Subject, ig, plus verb. Verb 1, yəni fillinin birinci korunışı qanday bolsa, şündə ilə gəcə faydalanamız. And SPS. İkinci dərəcəli gəb boləklərimizdən faydalanamız. Gəlin, bir misal yazıb olaylik. I go to school every day. Demək, bu yerdə kəlit sözümüz every day. Axamiyyət bilirəb sizlər mi? Fiyelinin birinci qorunuşunu tənləb aldım. Onun gəxə çıxan və qoşumçələr qoşmadım. Min xarqını məktəb ki, boraman. İndi bu yərdə yənə bir yadıngizdə səqləb qarşıngiz kərək borgən qaydamız bor. Bunu biz üçüncü şəxs birlikdə, yəni üçüncü şəxs birlikimiz bu, he, she və it. Aynı mənə şu üçüncü şəxs birlikimizdə bizdə dərək şəkilini yəsəşdə biraz özgərişlər sadır bolədi. Yəni biz... Uş bu olmaşlarımızdan faydalan yanımızda asasi fiilimizde ahirde kereyotken, yani tügeyotken harfi gekarab S ya ki ES koşumuz maksatke muafiq boladı. Akis halatta biz gramatik kopal hata ki yol koygen bolamız. Demek ki bunge xambar misal keltir bu otaman. She watches TV Every morning. U xar kunu tonda televizor koradı. Sizlarda savol uyğunayatken boluşu munku? Qays xoğalatda biz əs, qanday xoğalatda i əs dan faydalanamız. Demək, uş bu qaydanı xan biraz çün tırıb otaman. Agar asasi filmizinin axırgi xarfləri u, əs, double əs, CH, SH, or X. Mənə şu xarflər bilən tügəgən bolsə, siz itkilənməsdən dərək şəkildə. Hazır ki, o dey zamanda he, she, it. Üçüncü şəxs birlik üçün ES qoşumçasını qoşingiz kərək bolədi. Demək ki, aziz bolə cəllər, dərək gəb şəkilini biz orqanı bəldik. Axəmiyyət bir etkən bolsəngiz, biz bu yərdə xeç qəndə yardamcı fiillərdən faydalanmədik. Bu yərdə asıl da yardamcı fiilimiz do, və daz edi. İndi isə inkor şəkil gəyətib olamız. Qısqa çəkini qılıb çün tərədikən bolsam, biz inkor və soruq şəkilini do və daz kumakçilərimizdən, yəni yordamcı fillərimizdən faydalanıb yasab olamız. Demək, do qaysa olmaqlar üçün? Gəlin, isləb olaylik. I, we, you, they. Daz qaysalar üçün? Təbii ki, üçüncü şəxs birlik üçün biz dazdan faydalanamız. Xətta ki, siqnal tariqəsi də 
ESKE kuzingiz tüşü xam mümkün. He, she, it. Eslatı bu tümahçıman, darak gəpte kullanılgan ES'ni, yani he, she, it üçün biz Allah'ı da koyda kıl ve acilatıp aldık. Bana şu xalatdaki ES'ni biz soraq ve inkarda faydalanı almayımız. Çünkü biz onu tasavvur kulin yardımcı fiilge beri bir vardık. İngiliz tülü koydası ki muafıq, iki martta filmizge ve yardımcı fiilge ES yok ki ES koş imkanı mavcud emez. Bunlar ki ham kısa kalıp misal yazıp getemem. Does she like ice cream? O, muzkayma oğunu yakışık koradı mı? Or, I don't like I don't like football. Aziz böyle canlar, hamiyet bir yerdeki bolsengiz, mana bu yerde boluş kerek bolgen es koşumcası, yardım çiğil gibi ot sebep, biz bu yerdeki hiç kandı koşumcanı yazmaymış. İngiliz dili kaideleri yani gramatikası, present simple de ikte iyesini koşunu makullamaydı. İn kar şekilimizde ise biz duğen notunu koştuk ve abbreviation de batalarda bu kısartırış hasıl kıldık. I don't like football. Kurmatlı okuçularım. Korup turgeningizdik biz abu hava ve fasiller mazusunu organ çıkıp kalmay, biz onu koşumcu ravıştı, gramatik kaydelerini ham egellep aldık. Bundan kelip çıkadıgın borsa siz ham albatta buran var mazunu organ erikken siz onun içindeki berçe kanun kaydeler ge ahamiyetli borin. So my dear pupils, our lesson is about to end. I hope you get some information about the seasons and some grammar rules. As a homework, I want you to make some sentence according to our grammar in present simple. You can write about yourself, about your family or about your friends. But don't forget to use the present simple and of course adding ES and S to the third person singular. See you till the next lesson.